Hey guys, what's up? Um, happy Sunday. I am just going to come on and do a video quick on just how to make yourself look presentable in a very short amount of time. Um, I'm hoping that it's about five minutes, um, but I haven't timed myself yet. So um, maybe you have a you know work call that you have to hop on that you forgot about or you just you know want to wear a little bit of light makeup um, to make yourself look and feel good, but you don't want to do a full out look. So um, this is going to be very basic. This is what I wear if I'm going to go hang out at the pool for the day um, or if I'm just not feeling like doing a full beat look. So um, I'm just going to jump into it. Um, so I'm going to start with my Mary Kay CC cream. And I just do two to three pumps, which is kind of a lot, but just smear it on my face. Um, what I like about this for every day is that it has a pretty good light coverage, um, but it also has SPF and it blends in really easy so there's not a lot of fuss. I'm just going to take my sponge. This is the shade medium to deep. I could do the shade light to medium probably, but it might be just a little bit too light. And honestly, this takes the longest of all of the steps. It's just to blend it in. Make sure that you get it all over. So you can still see my freckles through this. It's light coverage. Um, it, you know, you can still see the psoriasis a little bit, but it does do a pretty decent job of just giving a nice wash of coverage. And then I'm gonna take my shape tape um, and I'm just gonna dot it under my eyes. just to um, brighten that area and also conceal my psoriasis. So same sponge. I put it over my eyelids and, and blend it over there again. I have psoriasis there and I just think it provides a little bit more of a seamless look. Okay, so we're brightened. I'm just gonna take the excess and put it on my nose. We're brightened, we're even, we look good. So I'm just gonna set it. Um, I'm gonna use the MAC Mineralized Skin Finish Powder. I'm just gonna take my brush and just mattify this and help set it for the day so that it doesn't move, stays on my face, and also gives me that matte look, which I prefer to the shiny look of the CC cream. Flip it over and use the big end. And just press this all over. Okay, um, so now I'm just going to take my butter bronzer. My neighbor slipped by going, what is she doing? Um, sorry, this is my butter bronzer from Physicians Formula. I'm gonna take my bronzer brush and just, um, rather than contour with this, I'm gonna just go more on my cheekbone. Almost more of using this like a blush and much more broad coverage. And I'm going to do it on my forehead. And we're just bronzing the skin where the sun would normally touch. I'm going to bring it down my, the bridge of my nose, my eyelids, and my chin. Okay, now I'm going to take the same um, bronzer and I'm going to use my fluffy brush that I use for you know all of my eyeshadow looks. I'm just going to swirl it in the bronzer and just run it back and forth in my crease. 
You don't have to do this, I just like this. I like the way this looks. Gives your eyes a little bit more dimension without um, doing a full eye look. Okay. Next I'm going to take my blush palette. I'm just gonna swirl in all of my blushes and just wake my face up with it. I bring it down my bridge and I actually do it a little bit on my eyelids as well. Um, just think it gives it a really natural look. Then I'm gonna curl my eyelashes. This really opens up my eyes in a step that I never skip ever. I don't care how much time you don't have, this will make you look like you are awake and that you give a darn about what you look like. Um, so a little trick to making it look like you're wearing more makeup than you are is to tight line your eyes. So this isn't very cute to watch, but you just put your eyeliner in, on, in your lash line. just looks like you're wearing a little bit more makeup than you are. And then I'm going to go in with my mascara and I'm going to use my Lily Lashes Mascara. I get my mascara everywhere, pretty much every time I do it. Um, wait for it to dry and then just use your fingernail and scrape it off where you flicked it on your face. But wait for it to dry, otherwise you'll smear it everywhere. So this is taking me a little bit longer because I'm, oops, talking through it, but it definitely takes under 10 minutes. Okay, so lastly, I'm gonna do my brows. I'm gonna use my um, Anastasia Brow Wiz. Um, it's got a spoolie, and so this honestly probably takes the longest. I comb them down. them in, comb them up. It's just hard to do while talking, so. Getting them to be even is a challenge. Okay. 
Um, and then I'm gonna hit it with this um, Benefit. I wish I knew what it was called. I'll figure it out, but it's got the little um, fibers just to help them make a little bit more full looking. Okay. And last up, some lip gloss. This is Iconic London Lip, lip Plumping Lip Gloss. Should get the makeup off my off of my lips first. Not a huge gloss girl, but in a pinch. Okay. So that's it. Um, just how to look presentable in under 10 minutes. Have a great day.